This is Sean for SundownOnly.com. Uh, this is going to be the first video of a few technical videos that we're going to do here in a series. Uh, this one is uh, why a capacitor doesn't really do anything for you. Uh, we've got an Alumapro 5 farad cap here. That is a carbon cap. That's the best thing going in the industry in terms of caps for this purpose. Uh, the electrolytic type uh, which is the, the long cylinders you see, those are often not the capacity they actually claim they are. Um, and even though they're one farad, uh, they're about the same size, uh, they don't usually perform as well as the carbon anyway. So this is a five farad, uh, to keep that in mind. Uh, some places always say you should do a, a thousand watts with one farad. Um, so this is saying that you should have a five thousand watt, uh, which Pro does not feel that way as they have four gauge inputs on this cap. Um, in this test setup, I've got the current clamp right here. Uh, this is the voltage for the cap itself and then the yellow meter is for the battery itself. So you can actually see the difference of what's going into the cap and into the battery with draw. Uh, I've got a load tester right up to 500 amps and an excess power uh, IntelliCharger that is set to 25 amps so you'll see where this is now at 14.7 after we go beyond 25 amps it's going to start drawing that's going to go to your battery power and your cap power I have two leads set up for draw uh, this set goes directly to the battery and this set goes directly to the cap there are two ways to wire this one is the right way one is the wrong way in order for a cap to be effective at all you have to go directly through the capacitor if you just have it tied on to the battery it's not actually going to do anything for you even more. Uh, you'll see the effects of that here. Um, so I've got connected to the cap directly and we're going to start with a very small draw. You watch the amperage here. So that's only 18 amps of draw. Doesn't affect it a whole lot because we've got the 25 amp charger. If we go more than that, now it goes to 46 voltage was actually lower on the cap than it was the battery so let's go a little bit higher we'll go up to 60 amps or so there you go 12.1 versus 12.6 so the cap was a half volt lower than the battery itself so anybody that's saying will it stop my dimming problem that may be because you got higher voltage at the battery but your amp is actually seeing less voltage so your power is not as good so there is a half a volt difference there we're gonna go to the 1000 amp setting on the clamp and try this again we're starting at 14.7 214 amps you can see a much larger difference so if you had you know 1500 1800 2000 watt amp there's a big big difference there I'll do that again so you can watch the one on the left and see exactly how low that goes over 200 amps we got below 9 volts that will kill your amplifier the battery we are still seeing 11 volts which is safe so in actuality using this capacitor or any capacitor could actually blow your amplifier because of low voltage now we'll go directly to the battery load so we're gonna start at a lower level again and this is the capacitor still connected but the load is going directly to the battery instead of the capacitor so again we're going to try up around 60 amps that went a little bit over but you see how much the draw went now we'll try up around 150 200 amps directly to the battery So we only dropped to 11.5, going over 250 amps for a surge there. 
So that is a very good demonstration of how the cap is actually not doing anything for you. And if you have it wired correctly, it's actually hurting your voltage. Uh, so keep that in mind anytime somebody ever says you shouldn't run a cap and you think it's actually doing something, it's actually hurting. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We've got more of these technical videos coming up. Uh, anything from what power you actually have versus what you think you have. And uh, tackling some other myths and other uh, random questions or things that people come up with that are very basic. But some people don't quite understand and need a better demonstration.